Good morning students welcome back to Shartha Math channel and this is a continuation video of the MZ coaching classes and in this video I am starting the Maths Vanni product of vectors topic and this is also the very very important topic from this topic also you will get the near T3 to 4 bits of the examination so all of you watch the video make the notes and practice the sums these are very very useful and important videos okay let us start the class the first one if a bar is equals to i plus 2j plus k and b bar is equal to 2j plus k minus i then what is the component of a bar perpendicular to b bar so what is the form the for this one the component of a bar perpendicular to b bar is equals to perpendicular to b bar means we have to take the formula as a bar minus component of a bar and b bar that is a dot b into b by mod b whole square okay this is the formula for the given question component of a bar actually the component of a bar and b bar is a dot b into b by mod b whole square but perpendicular to b bar means you have to take the a bar minus also so this is the formula a bar minus a dot b into b by mod b whole square now what is a dot b value a dot b is equals to i component into i component 1 into minus 1 is equals to minus 1 j into j 2 into 2 is equals to 4 k into k k component into k component that is 1 so this will be 4 okay the value of the a dot b is equals to 4 now substituting the values here in this formula that is a bar a bar is equals to i plus 2j plus k minus of a dot b value is equals to 4 into b bar is equals to minus i plus 2j plus k whole by mod b whole square mod b whole square is equals to mod b is equal to square root of 4 plus 1 plus 1 is equal to 6 that is mod b whole square is equals to 6 okay now cut this value this is 2 times this is 3 times now doing the lcm so this becomes 3i plus 6j plus 3k okay minus of minus plus 2i minus of 2 2 sir minus 4j minus 2k okay minus 2i plus 4j plus 2k but minus of all these values plus 2i minus 4j minus 2k okay whole by 3 so the answer is equals to 5i plus 2j plus k by 3 which is nothing but the third option okay that's all this is the answer just to, you have to replace the values in the formula to get the answer okay so the next one what is the orthogonal projection of the a bar on b bar the same formula orthogonal projection is nothing but the vector component the formula is on b bar means the direct formula is a dot b into b by mod b whole square if you have the term perpendicular to b bar is also then here we take the a bar minus ten but there is no perpendicular here the orthogonal component of a bar on b bar a dot b into b by mod b whole square now substituting the values first the value of the a dot b is equals to a dot b is equals to i component into i component 2 j into j minus 6 k into k plus 3 so this is equals to minus 1 okay 2 minus 6 plus 3 now what is mod b value mod b is equals to magnitude of this one square root of 1 plus 4 plus 1 that is root 6 so this is the value of the mod b now substituting the values here a dot b is equals to minus 1 b is equals to i minus 2j plus k by mod b whole square is equal to 6 and this is minus i minus of minus plus 2j minus k by 6 and which is nothing but the first option okay that's all this is the answer okay so the next one if a bar b bar two vectors are given and also given as lambda is equal to projection of a bar and b bar by projection of b bar and a bar then what is lambda value so what is given here lambda is equal to projection of a bar and b bar by projection of b bar and a bar what is the formula for the projection of a bar and b bar a dot b by mod b projection of a bar and b bar means a dot b by mod b projection of b bar and a bar means b dot a by mod a okay this is the formula now cut these values so this becomes only mod a bar by mod b bar is equal to mod a bar mod a bar is equal to square root of 36 plus 4 49 so root 49 is equal to 7 okay and mod b bar is equal to square root of 4 plus 4 plus 1 root 9 is equal to Therefore, the answer is equal to 7 by 3 and that is nothing but the last option. Dead is equation. Very, very easy. 
Okay, see so the next one. If a bar is equal to 4a plus 6 and b bar is equal to 3j plus 4k, then what is the vector form of the component of a bar along b bar is equal to? The vector component of a bar and b bar. What is the formula? Vector component a dot a bar and b bar a dot b into b b mod b whole square. Vector component are ordered through projection. For both of these two terms, formula will be same. a dot b into b b mod b whole square. Okay. So what is a dot b value? Finding this value, a dot b is equals to i into 0, 0, 6 into 3, 18 and 0 into k is equal to 0. There is no i term in the second vector and there is no k term in the first vector. So it is enough to take the product of the j component to j component only that is equals to 18 here and the value of the mod b is equals to square root of 9 plus 16 is equal to 25 that is equals to 5. Now substituting the values here in this formula so this is 18 into b vector is equal to 3j plus 4k by mod b square is equal to 25 that is nothing but the second option that's all that is the answer okay see so the next one if p bar is equal to 2 1 3 and q bar is equal to minus 2 3 1 and r bar is equal to 3 minus 2 4 and j is the unit vector in the direction of the y axis then what is the value of the 2p bar plus 3 q bar minus 4 r bar dot j okay so we want the this dot product value so first we have to find the value of the 2p plus 3q minus 4r first i am finding that value 2p plus 3q minus 4r is equal to okay 2p is equal to 2i plus j plus 3k okay 2i plus j plus 3k into 2 plus 3 into q bar is equal to minus 2i plus 3j plus k minus 4 into r bar is equal to 3i minus 2j plus 4k okay and this is equals to 4i plus 2j plus 6k minus 6i plus 9j plus 3k minus 12i plus 8j minus 16k and this is equals to 4 minus 6i minus 2i minus 2i minus 12 minus 49 2j plus 9j 11j 11j plus 8j that is 19j 6k plus 3k 9k 9k minus 16k minus 7k okay this is the value of the 2p bar plus 3q bar minus 4r bar but what is the given question we want the dot product of this vector with the j that is this value into j is equals to so minus 14i plus 19j minus 7k dot j that is equals to so taking the j component into j component that is 19 into 1 is equals 19 thirds of and that is the second option okay that's you see the next one the projection of the vector a bar is equals to 4i minus 3j plus 2k on the vector making equal angles with the coordinate axis and having magnitude is equals to 3 the projection of the vector a bar on the vector b bar making equal angles with the coordinate axis that is we have to find the projection of the vector a bar on the second vector what is that second vector the vector is directly not given here but one condition is given by using that condition you have to form that vector first after that you have to find the projection of a projection vector of a bar and b bar that is what is b bar given here this is the vector making equal angles with the coordinate axis having the magnitude is equal to 3 that is simply i take that that vector is equal to i plus j plus k see here i plus j plus k means i component is equal to j component is equal to k component means this is the vector that makes equal angles with the coordinate axis what is the condition for the vector to make the equal angles with the coordinate axis we have to take the values a1 is equal to a2 is equal to a3 clearly here we, we take the three values will be equal and having the magnitude is equal to root 3 now once you find the magnitude to this one then what you get mod b is equal to root 3 okay that is this is the vector that is the vector having the magnitude is equal to root 3 and making equal angles with the coordinate axis means i take that the b bar vector is equal to i plus j plus k now what is the given question projection of a bar and b bar projection of a bar and b bar means what is the formula the direct formula projection of a bar and b bar is equals to a dot b by mod b okay so what is a dot b value a dot b is equals to a vector is equals to here 4i minus 3j plus 2k dot b vector is equals to here i plus j plus k okay by mod b is equal to root 3 okay square root of 1 plus 1 plus 1 now doing the dot root so this is 4 minus 3 plus 2 okay by root 3 
6 minus 3. 3 by root 3. So, the answer is equal to root 3. That's all. And that is nothing but the second option. Okay. That's all. Where is the question? But here you have to find this vector before doing the question. That's all. See the next question. The sum of the length of the projections of pi plus qj plus rk on the coordinate axis where p is equal to 2, q is equal to 3, r is equal to 1 is. Sum of the lengths of the projections. The means here, the length of the projection from the vector to the x-axis is equal to p here. Okay. The length of the projection from vector to the x-axis is equal to p. And the length of the projection from vector to the y-axis is equal to q. And the length of the projection from vector to the z-axis is equal to r. Means here, these three values are nothing but the lengths of the projections of this vector on the coordinate axis. This on the x-axis, this on the y-axis, this on the z-axis. Okay. So, what is the given question? Sum of the lengths of the projections means we have to find the value p plus q plus r. Sum of the lengths of the projections, p plus q plus r. But what are the values here we have? 2 plus 3 plus 1. P is equal to 2. Q is equal to 3. R is equal to 1. So, answer is equal to 6 and that is nothing but the first option. That's all. Okay, see the next question. If P is equal to Q is equal to R is equal to S is equal to 4 vectors are given here. What is the length of the component of RS and PQ? Okay, length of the component of RS and PQ means the formula is RS dot PQ by mod PQ. Okay, this is the component. Length of the component is nothing but the only projection. Vector component is projection vector or the projection. Okay, length of the component that is only the projection. What is the projection formula? Or the RS dot PQ by mod PQ. So, first of all, we want the vectors Rs and Pq. What is Rs value? Os minus Or. Okay. Rs is equal to Os minus Or. That is Rs is equal to 3i minus 2j minus k. Minus of Or is equal to 2i minus 3k. So, the vector is equal to here. 3i minus 2i is equal to i minus 2j minus k plus 2k is equal to minus k plus 3k is equal to 2k. So, this is Rs value. And what is PQ bar? PQ bar is equal to OQ minus OP. That is OQ minus OP is equal to OQ vector minus I minus 2G minus of OP vector I minus K. So, this is minus 2I minus 2G minus of minus plus K. Okay. This is the PQ bar vector. Therefore, the vector component of RS and PQ is equal to RS dot PQ by mod PQ bar is equal to. What is the dot product of these two? minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 minus of minus plus 4 plus 2 okay whole by mod pq is equal to square root of 4 plus 4 plus 1 is equals to 9 so the answer is equals to 4 by 3 that's all which is nothing but the third option okay and i will continue the remaining sums in the next video